and so there is a movie if you can come with me if you will <laughs> by the name of the matrix i know some of you have watched it already praise god and many of you have said that it's foolishness but but let me just take you to a place just a bit <laughs> so the movie the matrix it has many elements of our christian faith if you remember the ship that they travel in is called the nebuchadnezzar are you with me somebody there's a character in that movie that is called trinity are you with me somebody and the land that they want to take them to the place of safety is called zion are you with me everybody so the movie the matrix is made up of christian elements and neo the star of the movie if you recall in the third installment of the movie how he died he died as a sacrifice and as a matter of fact when he died he did like this representing Christ are you with me everybody so now the matrix if we notice this the matrix is known as a system that human beings are born into but they don't know that they're in a computer system and so they are full thinking that everything they see everything they touch praise God is real but it's really not they are plugged into a computer and the computer tells them where to go, how to live, who to love, and everyone is just operating according to what the computer program says. But then there's a man by the name of Morpheus, and he comes to Neo and he tells Neo that you are a part of a system, something that is false, something that's not real. Now, in order for you to be free, he gave him an option to take a blue pill or a a red pill are you with me somebody yeah and so the blue pill he said if you take the blue pill then you're gonna wake up in your bed tomorrow and your life is gonna be as it has always been but then he said if you take the red pill red pill red 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 the red pill is the one that he's going to free him can i talk to you about red just for a bit the red represents the blood of jesus christ and it's so the blood it is what bought us and gave us freedom are you with me everybody yeah. And so when Neo ha, took the pill, ha, he was able to be free. But can I tell you something? Ha, there are some men in the movie ha, which are known as agents. Ha, before Neo ha, took the pill, ha, as soon as Mars ha, got in touch, ha, then the agents ha, started to pursue Neo. Ha, what is this telling us? Ha, your life was quite fine ha, before you start to come to church. Ha, your life was quite easy. Ha, before you started to come to church but as soon as you start to visit then you'll find now that the devil recognize you can I talk to somebody we are living in a spiritual world and so the devil never had any need to mess around you before why because he already had you but now as you step in to the house of the Lord he knows there's a possibility of you taking the red pill are you with me somebody he know there's a possibility of you being free and so we live in a time where everybody is a part of the system everybody is just doing things as they feel the system says go to school after you leave primary school go to high school and you leave high school School, then you go to college get a job get a wife or a husband have a family set it down are you with me somebody and so that part of the system is set where we have the good side and now we find that in schools they have stopped us from being able to discipline your children can I talk to you this a bit you're not able to discipline your children anymore there was a time when mothers all they had to do was just give a look parents can't discipline them pick me again we have children boxing no mommy boxing home daddy in school they tell the teachers don't touch them leave them alone teachers have no control over the children anymore so now those children grow up become 
rebellious feeling that they are entitled to do whatever they want because the next part of the system is to produce delinquents is to produce robbers is to produce murder can I talk to somebody because if we don't have them then there'll be nobody to go to prison oh God can I talk to somebody if we don't have them then the mark is not gonna make any money so the system is said to have the good and the bad are you with me somebody but I'm thankful to God for the red pill Paul said be transformed by the renewing of your minds that's why the devil doesn't like the church because the church is able to show man to show woman the truth that exists in this world we live in a world where the enemy has blinded people's eyes but I'm thankful to God that even though I was a sinner even though I did not deserve it I heard a song man said such love such love such wondrous love that God should love a sinner such as I I did not deserve it but there's something about grace grace step down into my situation grace step down into my issues I was wounded I didn't deserve it but when grace reached down I don't know about you but I've taken the red pill I'm not a part of the system when you take the red pill devil don't like you when you take the red pill demon can't stand you because when you take the red pill you know that Jesus said these signs shall follow them that call on me Jesus said they shall lay their hands on the sick and he shall see them recover Jesus said when you think any deadly thing it shall not conquer you the red pill I'm be walking by faith because faith is a substance of things hoped for and it's the evidence of the things not seen the devil don't like me because my eyes have been clear so I don't listen to the devil's music because I am a child of the king I was not made in China but me a genuine genuine holy ghost tongue talking blood wash fire baptized I'm 